Could relief at the pump be coming? Two Democrats have proposed suspending the gas tax for at least the rest of the year to help lower prices for drivers. Lauren Blanchard has more from Washington. Two Democratic senators want to put a few bucks back in your wallet when you fill up. $30 won't give me not even half a tank at this point no more because I get the most expensive one. Senators Maggie Hassan of New Hampshire and Mark Kelly of Arizona are facing tough re-election fights this year. They're proposing the Gas Prices Relief Act. It would suspend the 18.4 cent federal gas tax through the end of the year. Gas companies would be monitored to make sure they're passing savings to consumers and it would require the Treasury to keep making transfers to the Highway Trust Fund. The gas tax helps fund highway projects and public transit. And while any price reduction would be a relief, according to AAA, on average, gas is up more than a dollar compared to a year ago. By Memorial Day, Americans are going to have to dig deeper with potentially an average of $4 a gallon. It's unclear how successful the bill will be. Similar legislation has failed in the past, though a suspension seems to have some Republican support. We will actually combine our grocery tax elimination with suspending the gas tax increase for one year. The White House says they know Americans are hurting. Prices are too high. President Biden and his administration continue the push for more electric vehicles. And the future is clearly electric. Going electric, the president says it will not only combat rising gas prices, but also fight climate change and save drivers about a thousand bucks a year.